Like we mentioned before the break, today marks International Women's Day, celebrating the achievements of women around the world. Western Mass News reporter Libby James takes a local look, stopping by American Medical Response in Springfield, where for the first time, the leadership is all female. People aren't used to seeing two females roll up in an ambulance, so changing that perception and seeing everyone's just as capable, but equally trained, and it's just gets the job done. Kim D'Angelo is operations manager at the American Medical Response in Springfield. She tells Western Mass News she started her career 17 years ago when it was a fully male-dominated field. We have so such a variety of roles that are staffed by women at this point that there's all different avenues people can choose to go. Emily Chandler, the program director of EMT and paramedic programs, started her EMS 20 years ago and worked her way up. Being a woman in this field, being a leader, has allowed the door to open for other females to come up into the positions of EMT and paramedics. AMR Springfield is 36% female staff with women in positions as leadership roles, supervisors, paramedics, dispatchers, and EMTs. We spoke to some of the EMTs who tell us their abilities are sometimes questioned when responding to scenes, but they don't let that stop them. We get a lot of comments about being small, especially females, and it's funny because I feel like we're just as capable and we're stronger sometimes, and so um, we do get a lot of comments, and it's nice to be able to prove them wrong and show them we are strong and competent and smart and, and motivated as well. In Springfield, Libby James for Western Mass News. Bernard.